Next, star chef Hubert Keller is ready to Rio, ready to find its best restaurants, its hottest chefs, and its celebrated street food, ready to find divine meats, its most famous dishes, and drink some great local beer. So get ready to Rio with chef Hubert Keller, starting now. If you love beer the way I love beer, we are here at Jeffrey's store. It's probably the finest and best microbrewery in Rio de Janeiro, and their beer is represented in every major restaurant in the city. I'm excited to try it, so come with me for the experience. Hey, Chef. Hey, Susan. <laughs> Such a pleasure, really. Welcome a... to the Jeffrey store. Oh, my God. <laughs> so that's your world right here, right? Yeah. Oh, my God. This thanks. is our concept store. We are a microbrewery in Rio de Janeiro. And we are passionate about art creation, and it would be an honor to receive you here. Oh, it's good. And talk about art, right? We invite three artists to fusion art. And what's up there, Jason? Oh, this is our creative lab. Uh, this is the most important place. Here, we develop many recipes. Uh, our minds are free, totally free. It's like a test kitchen for you guys, right? The perfect definition. Uh, for me, it's like playing jazz. Imagine put uh, some chef uh, with us, uh, creating without rules, so uh, mixing ingredients. I can wait until I play music with you up there also later on, because I am into music. <laughs> Let's compose now. That's right. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> This is our dream. We made our dream inside this. Is that right? Let me it's introduce. Like a tower here, right? <laughs> <laughs> Let me introduce our tanks. Here is the start of the process. Uh, it's the first step, and we put some barley. Oh yeah, that's right. This is barley, and we put barley in water. This is the soul of the beer. This is the most important ingredient. The creativity, right? To start yeah, there. Yeah. So Jill. Tell me what's happening in the tank. It's a surprise. Do you want to know? Yes, <laughs> yes, I want to know, yeah. <laughs> we prepared just for you. Really? So you did a brew just for me? 30 days ago, we wow. are creating a beer here. Imagine this moment. So it comes. Let's try it. Let's try it. <laughs> I can wait. Yeah, I think you light, light, totally. But at the same time, you need to uh, drink more and more. I feel very special, really feel very special that actually we're brewing a beer just for me, knowing that I'm coming, so I will have some more. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, <laughs> cheers. <laughs> So, Chef, this is our Jeffrey Gallery. Uh, here we exhibit many talents around the city, and month on month we exchange. So, people uh, can go to drink a beer and be inspired. Because we are not a, a, a beer brand, we are a beer for us. It's like a platform to express uh, ourselves, to express our lifestyle. So, beer is like a platform. And I can feel the vibe when you're here. I really do. Oh my! <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's dig in, right? So it's all about yeah, totally. beer, beer, and a cheese pairing, right? So, <laughs> all right, let's. Let's taste. It's funny because in the past you don't have this yeah. kind of cheese. All this cheese is local, it's Brazilian, it's like artisanal. It was amazing to see all those cheeses, something that did not exist when I lived in Brazil in the early 80s. I mean, I have to admit, I'm so impressed to see so many cheeses made in Brazil, artisanal cheeses, but here we have some fabulous goat cheeses. We have an aged cheese, like a two years old aged cheese. And look, all these artisanal breads that you can find now in Brazil. It's very impressive. Okay, oh, that's this one. All right. Three years to get in this point. My God, three yeah. years, yeah? Three years. When you're waiting for 30 days for the beer, right? And these guys have to wait three years, right? <laughs> You know, chef, uh, this beer have uh, lemon peels, coriander seeds, 
And when we pairing with cheese, this explodes in your mouth. Yeah, and being a chef, really, when we talk about pairing, I, I, I agree, the beer that I tasted, you actually had a chance to taste, is so food friendly, right? It's amazing. I think we have to toast to that, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it's a good idea. <laughs> Touring Jeffrey Beer with Jelson, and much more. <laughs> it was going to be hard to leave. So I was thrilled when our friends at Jeffrey Beer planned a real karaoke barbecue for our last evening. Karaoke barbecue really represents the lifestyle, the essence of Rio de Janeiro. It's all about having friends, family, music, beer, a little bit of sun, and that's all you need. It was held in a beautiful location that overlooks the water. There was a live band, Lots of dancing. And of course, an endless supply of extra cold beer. Just the way Carioca's like it. Carioca's love really good meat and really good beer. Opa! And for sure, there was plenty of really good meat. The heart of the party was the lavish barbecue arranged by Pedro from Iraja. No one could resist the sights and smells of the mouth-watering Brazilian beef that lined the grill. Steaks, huge ribs, roasts, and sausages. The side dishes were everything you expect at the Carioca barbecue. Salsa, rice with jerk beef, farofa, even farofa made with green tea potato salad, and some beautifully grilled vegetables. Carioca barbecue, it will start usually sort of early afternoon and it runs and runs and runs. So maybe by midnight, one o'clock, people start taking taxis home. But it's an all day experience. It's a holistic experience. It's food, it's music, it's drink, it's everything together. Everything I love about Rio had come together in one place. Amazing food, people with great passion and spirit, intoxicating music, and a spectacular scenery. A fantastic way to end the trip. Thank you for coming here. Thank you guys for hosting us. No, I really want to thank you. And I think we, we probably didn't have the sun up here, I think, but you created a sun in our hearts. Oh, thank you. Thank Cheers. you. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to Rio Janeiro. Rio! Rio! <laughs>